morning guys this morning I've been thinking about this I actually was up real early this morning I couldn't sleep I was thinking about um, our goals goals that I make particularly and how we naturally can put up walls with you know negative comments negative thoughts you know, I can't do this um, it's easier for me to lay down you know we come up with so many excuses but there's other types of walls that can be put up uh, by individuals around you and th these individuals can be friends family acquaintances anyone anyone even someone you do or don't know um, now these walls that can be put up can limit you so it's important to think about the people that are around you and who you allow to indoctrinate your way of thinking and what I mean by that is People will be around you and they will give you an idea of what could be good for you. You know, how you could do better. What you could be doing and where you could be going. And these ideas may be great. They, they may put you in a position where you have hope. But it's more important to have hope in yourself and in your future that you create for yourself you want to be independent you want to be independent mentally and financially so I hope this helps um, like I said I was thinking about this all morning just thinking about the places I want to go, the things I want to do, and I can't do the things, I can't do all the things that I want to do with everyone that is around me. I would love to take everybody with me to do all a bunch of fun things, and all we ever did was fun, but there are people that limit themselves, and I'm not perfect. I'm sorry, I don't want to put that out there. I aspire to be perfect. But there are individuals in your life that you will find that they may be wonderful people, but their ideas or their thinking patterns are small in comparison to what you may have going for yourself and what you may want for yourself. And that doesn't mean that you have to totally cut them out of your life, but it does mean that you can't allow other individuals to be the fuel for your desire. Your desire has to come from your emotion and for what you truly want for yourself. So, like I said, I hope this helps. I hope it gets the cogs going, uh, turning. Perhaps this enlightened you to, you know, maybe if there's something out there that you're wanting to do, do it. And if you do it bad, at least you're doing it. No one can't say that you didn't try. So have a great day, smile, make some friends, good friends, and I'd like to end this with some positive affirmations. If you're ever in doubt and you're feeling like you can't do something or you don't know where to go, don't focus on the negative, focus on the positive and just tell yourself, I am great, I am powerful, I am abundant in prosperity, I am wealthy, I am healthy, I'm a good father, I'm a good mother, I'm a good son, I'm a good daughter, I'm a good friend, 
I am capable. Good things are supposed to happen to me. Anytime you're thinking negative thoughts, stop focusing on it and start throwing out positive affirmations. You'll be amazed at how powerful these quick sentences can not only help you to empower you in the moment, but also start the process of reprogramming your subconscious mind to really get you thinking and going in the right direction for yourself and for others. You guys have a great day. Thank you.